Sharks, my name is Ellie. I'm from San Francisco, California. And I am seeking $500,000 in exchange for 5% of my company, Hello. Wow. Booty wow. Bag. Yeah. Booty Bag is an affordable, comfortable, and convenient way for women to shop for underwear. I started Booty Bag because I was sick of going to the mall, the semi-annual sales, the clearance bins, the sales clerks, I want to give women that sexy feeling of sliding on a new pair of underwear without all the hassle or expensive price tag. So here's how it works. You select how many pairs you want to receive in a month, your size, your style option, and for just $10, we'll deliver your new favorite undies all without leaving the comfort of your couch. Our mission is to not only bring a necessity to women at an affordable price, but to create a community that represents all women. This brand is made for women, by women, and with every pair purchased, we donate to women in need. So Sharks, who's with me in making all women feel good in their undies? Uh, terrific thing. Ellie, Amazing. is it a subscription service? Yes, it is. It's a monthly subscription. You're not committed to anything. So you can get one pair for $10 or two for 15. You can get all four for 20. So you really haven't made any money yet. I mean, we net 5%. Whoa. Successful clothiers that have real scale make 15% pre-tax. Yeah. You're at five, so there's 10% yeah. of cost in here, and I think I'm gonna find it all in the inventory. Yeah. And so you gotta get rid of that. You gotta partner. It's yeah. worth giving up some of this equity to your manufacturer yes. to solve this problem. Yes, you nailed it. But in order to make money, I need to be big, and I have manufacturing problems. You're serving almost as a retail store for them. Right. They manufacture. Right then they wholesale it to you. Right. And you're kind of at their mercy because you're not going direct to the factory. Yeah, totally. And they know me as well. So in the four years I've grown up with them, they've never been a partner to me. How are they treating you? I'm terribly. just curious. Absolutely they treat you terribly. Unbelievable. <laughs> are they yeah. men? Are they women or men? Um, men, yes. What a surprise. Yeah. They have never, ever been flexible with me. Um, they've made me take product that was actually you know, stained or damaged, and like I just had they to don't, do well, it. Because, you should have just sent it back and said no. Well, they know that every month I have to, on the fifteenth, put out products. So, so this is a pain, this is a real pain point for it you. It is, yeah, and that's why I'm here. You know, Ellie, I love you. Um, oh my God. First of all, I am. <laughs> I am so <laughs> impressed with you. Thank you. You, what you have created with three hundred dollars, how you have harnessed the power of social media. You're creating a movement around your brand, yeah. which is Hell so yeah. unbelievable. You know my story. I started with five hundred dollars out of my extra bedroom. The first few years, my margins also were not what they are today because I wasn't able to harness great manufacturing deals. I didn't have the production I needed. But over the last eighteen years, those things have been able to change, right. right? I don't want you to have to wait 18 years. And <laughs> I didn't you. take an investor for the first 10 years wow. I ran my business. I did it on credit card debt, lines of credit, LOCs. Mm -hmm. I mean, you name it, it was hard, right? Mm -hmm. And one of the things I wish I would have done earlier is bring in somebody as an investor who had a vested interest that could have helped propel me quicker than right. taking 18 years. And I think I'm the shark that can do that for you. We have one offer here, okay? Yeah. Kendra and I combined for 20% of your business for 500,000. Would you guys go up to 700,000 for 20%? Wow. For 700 for 20%? Who's yeah. a shark? Absolutely not. Yeah. No. You're not worth 10 million today. And okay. when you bring on the right team, that is worth more than you could ever put on a check. Right. But you have to feel comfortable with that too. Yeah. You know, 20% just feels a little high, I, and I'm not undervaluing you guys at all. I uh, appreciate both of your offers. It just it was a little bit higher than I wanted to go with. I'm willing to do it at 15. OK, I'll go back to my original offer if you're not comfortable with that. I'll do 500 for 10%. Excuse me, did you just abandon me? I abandoned you. It sounds wow. like I abandoned you because I could see in her face that that made her feel sick and made her feel less than, and made her worth feel not valued, and I can't, I So can't. you're willing to do it for 10%? With my original offer. I think 10 is, is fair, based done. on my experience. Let's not even think about it anymore. <laughs> That's yes. done? Yeah. Done. Woo! Wow. I love it, I'm Barbie. so excited. <laughs> Sorry, I 
appreciate you guys, Don't everybody. Don't you apologize, oh terrific partner. Thank yeah. you. Congratulations. The golden ticket goes to my favorite product. I've made you a good offer. That's what I'm talking about. That is the winner. Riding all the way to the bank, baby. Yeah. You've come to the right place.